evening, folks. We're going to get into there with Bob Seger and the Silver Bullet Band. Bob Seger, do you excuse me? Like a rock, like a rock. Not too long ago, I made a comment um, saying, you might be thinking I'm living under a rock. Sometimes some of the music uh, or artists I've never heard and you're like, Wait, where's this guy living? He's living under a rock. And I said, welcome. This is what it looks like to live under a rock. So welcome to the rock. All right, and this is called Like a Rock. So thank you so much. Uh, guys, before I do begin, I want to thank Chuck. It's Chuck uh, for putting the request out there on Patreon. There is a link below in the description box with how you can get involved with the channel and all that good and groovy stuff as we endeavor to create a community of music lovers for the foreseeable future. All right, so do enjoy. Stick around. Uh, guys, you can also support the channel by giving it a subscribe, giving the video a like, and also giving the video a comment, all right? Even sharing it, all right? It helps a lot. Uh, it does sustain the channel and create momentum. All right, so with that said, let's jump in. So it's a first time listen, first time reaction, guys. There is a Bob Seger playlist here on the channel. Only thing I'll say about this gentleman is, just like Bruce Springsteen, you might think, how dare you put them both in the same sentence? I can, I can, right? There are a few artists I'd like to put, there are actually a few artists I would like to see collab. Now that I'm reacting to their music, I wouldn't mind seeing a few of these artists doing uh, a club, you know, working together on a song. Yeah, imagine that. Imagine a Chris Stapleton um, pairing up with Bob here and then doing a song. Who would have thought, eh? That'd be something, eh? So these are the thoughts that are kind of always like, wow, what if? What if that happened? I know Chris done some work with Justin Timberlake. We have done a reaction to some of their songs here on the channel. Uh, but imagine, you know, some of these artists. Anyway, I'm, I'm going off on a tangent. We're going to jump in with this reaction. It's a first time listen, first time reaction. Got no idea what the song's about, but we let the music do the talking. All right, so let's jump in. Stood there bowling, sweating in the sun. Felt like a million, felt like number one. The height of summer, I'd never felt that strong Like a rock I was 18, didn't have a care Working for peanuts, not a dime to spare But I was leaning, solid everywhere A few things I want to mention here guys your symbol, the symbolism of the train. You might think I'm looking too deep into it, but look, this train going by. Uh, Bob sitting there, listening, uh, watching the train go by. Traveling Wilburys, end of the line. They're on the train, right? And symbolically, though, know, and I was, I, I made a connection. Like life, you know, sometimes it's like a train. You know, you don't know when your stop's going to be, when, whenever your stop's going to happen. We don't know, right? It's, it's just, it just goes. You're on that train. He, there he is, watching that train ride by, and as it's riding by, flashback into his youth. And uh, here we go. So this video in itself does have a like, it's, it's, it's really, here he is chilling out when he's 18 in the summer. And that train just symbolizes, I guess, life passing by almost. Who knows? We'll see. Didn't have a care. Working for peanuts. Yeah. Not a dime to spare. But I was leaning. Solid everywhere. Like a rock My hands were steady My eyes were clear and bright My walk had purpose My steps were quick and light And I held firm To what I felt was right Like a rock Like a rock I was strong as I could be Like a rock Nothing ever got to me Like a rock I was something to see Like a rock And I stood arrow straight Unencumbered by the and their schemes I stood proud I stood tall high above it all I still believed in my
I, I dazed out for a second. 20 years now. All right. The guitar bit's done. This is a great reflective piece. You know, and he's gone where his audience has gone. You know what I mean? So he's not making songs about, like, up in the club and partying and that. He's saying, like, I was a sight to be seen. I was like a rock back when I was 18, yo. I, be I had beliefs. I could spot the schemes and the hustlers didn't have time for any of that. Didn't have any time for that monkey business at all. Didn't have any time for it. I was a rock. I stood firm. That was a sight to be seen, sight to behold. But where are we now, Bob? Where are we now? Tell us. This is a great reflective piece. And I'm sure his audience, his fan base resonate to it. They really do. Apart from the fact that it's a fantastic uh, visually, as well, uh, I love. Like, I wonder at the end of the video if we'll go back to him in this car where we left him, and then he drives past that train track. You know, we'll see. Where they go? Twenty years, I don't know. I sit and I wonder sometimes where they've gone. And sometimes late at night Oh, when I'm bathed in the firelight The moon comes calling a ghostly way And I recall I recall Like a rock Standing arrow straight Like a From the gate, like around, carrying the weight, like around, oh, like around, the sun upon my skin. At the end of the video, went back to him. He just drove over the tracks, just as I predicted. Awesome! That is, that is a uh, that song right there is basically uh, a kind of a f you to your grandkids <laughs> or your own kids. You know, play them this song, play them this song, and be like, "Look, I used to be like a rock kid. I used to be like the rock." If you can smell what the rock's cooking. Oh, right, I don't want to spoil the reaction by going into wrestling and that. Not that I used to watch wrestling or anything, but who can't remember the rock and Stone Cold Steve Austin? But anyway, the point I'm trying to make is why I said you can sort of it's 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 a song that sort of takes you back down memory lane. And the, and the, when I, as I was listening to the song, I couldn't help but think, you know, there was a line from a song from a, 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 a Robbie Williams song, and um, he says in that song, "Youth is wasted on the young." Youth, think about it. Youth is wasted on the young. You know what I mean? I mean, if that makes any sense. And this song basically, uh, in essence, conveys that message. It almost because you—that's what I felt anyway. It's—it's—it's it, it's, it's good. It, it's a song you can drive to, song you can kick back, relax, and and reminisce on. I guess the 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 yesteryears. 
so to speak. But, you know, we got to live in the present moment too. So come on, Bob. You know, I'm with you, man. I'm, I'm, on, I'm in your corner. I'm in your corner, my friend. Present times too. So that was like a rock and loved it. It's good to how he can articulate his thoughts and then uh, put it into a song like this, especially with the guitar solos in there as well. So that was pretty nice. Interaction was, just the whole thing was smooth. And it was just, he has this kind of voice there, which just sounds so uh, distorted in a positive way, but it just has this kind of um, edginess to it. That's the word. It has a slight edge to it. Bob Seger. All right. All right, guys, that was my reaction. Bob Seger and the silver bullet band, Like a Rock. All right. So make sure you are staying safe. If you haven't already, give the comment. Give the, give the comment. <laughs> Give the video a comment. Give it a like. Give it a share. All right. It does help sustain and support the channel. All right. So I'll catch you in the next one. Make sure you are staying safe. Peace.